Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. There are a number of misconceptions which are found amongst us Muslims regarding the political directives of Islam. One of these uh, misconceptions is that uh, in case Muslims are directed, Muslims who are living in non-Muslim lands, they are directed by law to do something which is uh, according to their own beliefs is against Islam, then they must violate these laws, they must, uh, they must break these laws, they make a, must preach these laws. Now this is not an absolutely right uh, comprehension of what Islam intends to say in this matter. Islam says that whenever we, we, we depart to a non-Muslim country, we live there, we know that we live in a contract with them. And honoring that contract means honoring all their laws. And honoring a contract is very important to God. We know that the Quran says, Keep your covenants because indeed on the day of judgment you will be held accountable for them. In other words, whenever we move to a non-Muslim country, we are bound by a certain covenant, a certain pledge which we have made with them when we stay there. And the part of this pledge is whether that we cannot break laws of that country. We cannot create nuisance there. We cannot create a law and order situation there. Of course, if they deny Muslims some basic rights, if they force them to do something which is against Islam, this would be a persecution on their part. We cannot condone that. But on the other hand, Muslims cannot be advised at all. They must, they must be told on the, on the head very clearly that they must not and they cannot violate the laws of that country. If they think that certain laws are uh, making them breach their own religion or they are making them, uh, induce them inducing them to be disrespectful or to not follow their own religion, then of course they should peacefully protest and they should bring the whole issue before the authorities of that area. But if this does not work, then they must not break these laws and the proper course for them would be to either suffer this persecution or to migrate from that country. Breaking those laws, creating nuisance there at that place or creating a law and order situation at that place is absolutely an uncalled for behavior and Muslims must realize this. أقول قولي هذا واستغفر الله لي ولكم ولسائر المسلمين والمسلمات